Hi again everyone, I'm back and I have another challenge and this is the big challenge that I mentioned right at the start of lockdown and it's the splits. Now this is going to be front splits. Obviously this is a very intense stretch so you must, must, must be warmed up. This is an end of workout, end of skating session, exercise, don't do it cold, it's just a bad idea. Um, I'm going to start off with showing it from a nice simple method that you can use when you're first starting out and you can take it as low as you can get and then I'll show you some variations. Now all of these are going to start lay down to the floor, nothing's going to start from a height and dropping into them. Things like kick splits and stuff, that's for way later on. You need to look at how to do those properly with good technique. This is just a starting out and a basic way of practicing it that you can use to get you going. So we're gonna start on the floor, we're gonna sit on our bottom and we're gonna open up one leg behind us into like an American split so we're getting that nice turn out. Now you should have already done lots of warm up of the hip flexors, so things like this, um, some pigeon to get your hamstrings and hips and glutes and everything warmed up. So you should have done loads and loads of warm up before you even get to this point. So anyway, American split first. So we're just turning the knee out slightly over 90. Okay, and then I'm gonna slowly straighten out the back leg first. I'm obviously slightly offset. I need to now rotate myself around. Okay, so I'm into almost a split there and then I can just gently push down with this is still fairly turned out the back. I've got a pointer toe because I love a pointer toe. And I'm keeping my back up straight. Try not to hunch in, okay? Or like flop or lean. Try to pull yourself up. Try to square off. So there I made a little adjustment. To test that, bring the opposite arms into opposition around your body. So the front leg, the opposite arm goes forward. Back leg, the opposite arm goes behind. And that's gonna square you off and force you into that better position. Okay, so that's your starting off split. Then you can start to play with things like leaning forward, making sure you go up and over. So your elongating spine, and it's not just hunched like this, because it's good practice, but lengthening forward, I'm taking my arms beyond my foot. You can start to lean backwards. And then things like get in that position there. And some people might need to go further back. I'll show you on the other side. You're going to have a good side and not so good side. This coming up is my not so good side. Um, so I go down again, start off opening that into that American split, and I start to rotate forward. And there you go. I can get there, try to straighten that back leg. Okay, pull up, check that squareness of the opposition, and then you can start to do a lot of additions. Um, if you're very comfortable in split, the next stage is to go to over split. So, I will get my props. So, over split involves creating height. So, I'm going to give myself some cushions. Okay, first off, we can try with just one leg on the cushion. So, I'm going to put four on the front there. Obviously you start off with just a single one and you can build up until you get to a higher point and you just bring one leg up in front and you can sit into it. You can also do this when you're starting out to help but be very careful, make sure you put your weight over those hands when they're taking it and gradually dropping. With any kind of stretch, use your breathing. Inhale then push in a little bit deeper on the exhale. Really this is more advanced. This, the one with just one in front is okay. I just asked now, what I'm going to do in a minute is a much more advanced version. I should only be done when you're confident in your splits. So you can push in. And again, start with just a single cushion so that you're not overdoing it. Keep the body up strong. Keep secure, keep forward. So that's version one. Version two, I'm going to put cushions both ends of the mat. Okay. And 
going to put our back leg up, front leg up. And what's going to happen here is gravity is going to kick in. So you're going to be pushed lower than your split. So I'm actually dipping down into that position, meaning that I've got a slightly increased split. Again, keeping the body up. I'm going to take one arm off. I'm not going to take two arms off because I don't feel secure in the position on this occasion. Okay, strong. And that's going to force a deeper split. That's an advanced variation. Well, that's the forward splits, everyone. That was my split challenge. We've been working up to it. There's tons and tons of videos to go back to that are dealing with stretches that build you up to this point. This is an end result. Okay, so go back, do the work, and it might take weeks, it might take months, it might take years, but be patient with it. This is where you're aiming to. Go with the stages, go with the steps, take your time. It's important you take it gradually and safely, okay, and that you don't push yourself too far too soon. All right, everyone. Bye-bye.